All right, welcome back. Talking some Division Three basketball now at the beach, where the Marlins of Virginia Wesleyan are off to a pretty hot start. Nathan Epstein has more. I like uh, the group's potential, and I feel like we got some really good pieces and some depth. It bodes for a, a good recipe for success. And Virginia Wesleyan's off to its most successful start in more than a decade. 11 wins in its first 12 games, with their only loss in that stretch coming to the defending national champions from Randolph-Macon. We're still a young group, uh, you know, and uh, I think sometimes we're a work in progress, but. I think the talent's there. Now in his 23rd year as the Marlins head man, Dave Macedo has been leading on Amari DeVoe. Oh, is a big piece of the puzzle. The stud sophomore from Richmond is one of the top 15 scorers in the conference. Coach has, has put so much trust in me in making the right play, whether it is scoring, whether it is getting my teammates the best shot, or getting just the whole team the best shot. No better example of that than a few weeks ago when O connected on the game-winning shot at the buzzer to beat Christopher Newport University, at the time ranked the number one team in the nation. <laughs> As soon as he got the ball, I seen that look, you know, he got the ball, he was out, he was gone. I was like, oh yeah, that's in, it's going there. I knew it was going there. That's going to be a memory that I'm never going to forget. He's just got a, a high level of confidence. He, he's a, you know, a ferocious kid. He, he's fearless at times. And you can really push his buttons to get him going. There's always a reminder of where this program's been, and it's hanging high above the rafters, above the Marlins' home court. They won the national championship back in 2006, then made the Final Four in 2015, but they haven't been back to the NCAA tournament since. And that's something the Marlins say they are hungry to change. And we're all hungry. We're starving. It's every kid's dream for real just to even be a part of the NCAA tournament. And the closer that we get, the more we want it. You know, the hungrier we are. I think the potential is really high, really high. I think I think this is the year we get back to it. We got to fight, claw. We got to win all the games we're supposed to win. And, and hopefully we can have an opportunity at the end that if we do not take care of business in the ODAC tournament, we'll still get a fighting chance to get in. Macedo and the Marlins back in the mix. In Virginia Beach, Nathan Epstein for the Sport Wrap.